In this video we're going to be looking at still protective leg wear and how it actually goes about protecting the operator. Um, to explain a little bit about how the leg wear works, uh, inside um, our chaps here, they can be chap version which is the ones that clip around your leg or they can be the trousers like the ones I'm wearing. Um, they all uh, are working off the same uh, system. We have about nine layers of a Dyneema Kevlar type fabric. It's a coarse woven fabric. And uh, we refer to it as a, a blocking fabric because the coarse fibers get picked up by the teeth of the sword chain. They get dragged through uh, the sword chain and they just basically choke or block up uh, the drive sprocket. Um, to go through the exercise of showing you how this works, uh, we'll be using the MS500i, which is a fairly serious chainsaw, and it's fitted with the full chisel chain. It's a fairly, fairly serious chain, and uh, we'll be cutting into our basic entry-level chaps. Uh, whether they're basic entry-level or whether they're the advanced uh, professional uh, pro uh, legwear that I'm wearing here, uh, they all meet the same standards and can do the same job. To demonstrate this, we'll put the chaps just over a log to simulate someone's leg. totally jammed up, totally blocked up, and you can see this fiber that's been wrapped all around it. It's choked up the drive sprocket that's driving it. That chain is locked up and can't go anywhere. And when I look through the uh, cut here, you can see a um, couple of points where it's cut in. But if we flick it over, clean and no sign of it coming through. So there's no chance that it's actually even gone through anywhere near touching the leg and so that was full throttle full chain speed slammed it into the log uh, and we haven't made it through and the operator is safe as you can see the system really works and if you want to know more uh, visit our online store or call into your local still specialist dealer